interesting, to say the least. We're going to Balmora, and the Republic is apparently invading that world, is what I'm hearing. So... Glad to share my skills with someone talented. We can spar any time. No abilities to buy, apparently. For now, we're going to head to Balmora and see what happens when we get there. But this is it, everyone. We're going straight into a war zone. And this will be a new experience for Sogahi because as much as he's been a little cocky sometimes, and we've been in more than a few fights, but we have never been in an honest to god war zone uh, or in that kind of combat situation so this will be a very new experience for us and I'll be interested to see how everything goes Right then, off to Balmora. Let's go. Which is in the Core World territory. Let me see, that's level. 32 to 36. We're still about 10 levels ahead. And uh, it was apparently once an independent corporate manufacturing world, defended by the Republic and conquered by the Empire. There's a resistance there, and they don't exactly like having the Empire in charge. Uh, oh, so it's... We're not actually in an official war with the Empire yet. The Republic is just assisting uh, the resistance movement. So we've got a sort of Vietnam-style uh, guerrilla war going on against the Empire on Balmora. Uh, Interesting. Master Braga told me you were coming. Warren Sidoru. A pleasure. I'm grateful for your assistance. The situation is growing desperate. The Republic picked an unfortunate time to drive the Empire off Balmora. It's made our team's mission that much harder. How so? Military reinforcements ought to make our job easier, not harder. My strengths lie in observation, subtlety, and negotiation. Not exactly welcome talents on the battlefield. Balmora is home to the largest weapon manufacturing plants in the galaxy. Half the munitions used in the last war originated on this world. The Empire develops horrific new instruments of destruction here. Balmora's creations have killed countless innocents. All that terrible power in the hands of the Sith. We can't let them keep it. I appreciate the sentiment, but be mindful of our mission. We're here for one particular item. We've learned the Empire has a cloaking device prototype at one of Balmora's advanced weapon factories. It's the same technology hiding the Emperor's fortress. If we obtain that cloaking device prototype, we can understand how it works, develop a way to see through it. That's very interesting. So, reverse engineering that prototype also would be nice. We could build our own stealth ships. That would certainly give the Republic a bit of a one-up against the Empire in the war. But where did they get this? How did the Empire develop cloaking device technology? They didn't. Intelligence indicates the prototype is alien in design. Possibly Rakata or Gree. Finding the cloaking device prototype is almost impossible thanks to the invasion. We need experienced native guides to sort through the chaos. Balmora has a well-established civilian resistance. Their spy network's knowledge of the Empire would be invaluable. Uh, yes, it would be, but... 
I am sensing a butt coming up. Your tone indicates there's a complication. War breeds chaos, chaos breeds confusion, and confusion breeds mistrust. Unfortunately, the Resistance doesn't trust the Republic. Despite my best negotiations, they remain uncooperative. Can't say I blame them. The Empire's driven us off this planet twice already, leaving the Resistance holding the bag. Republic Command just intercepted a distress call. A Resistance medical facility is about to be overrun. I'd go, but an Imperial armor column's in my way. I need you to save that medical facility. Well, it's a chance to give the Empire a bit of a bloody nose and give the Balmoran Resistance some genuine help. I like this idea. Give me those coordinates. I'll break that siege. Where am I going? I'm sending the medical facility's location. I don't know what you'll be facing there, but do whatever you must to save the Resistance fighters. I'll meet you there as soon as I can. May the force be with you. Hey, I killed Darth Angrel and five others and five of his apprentices. How hard can it be? Well, four of his apprentices, I guess. Not counting Praven, obviously, who we did not kill. Oh, hey, T7. You want a word? You wanted to talk? <laughs> Trying to rebuild Shahu's report. Data files badly corrupted. T7 dishonest with Jedi about what? Come clean, T7. I need to know what's going on. <laughs> you worked with Shaku Master Zello. Uh, gave T7 to Master Zello. That doesn't seem like too big a deal, honestly. Don't worry about it, Why? little fella. I thought you had some dark, terrible secret. <laughs> Yeah. Believed he was a good guy. Well, everyone makes mistakes, and I'm not surprised he made some, too. Nobody's perfect, T7. You may have misjudged Shafu's character, but you can't beat yourself up over it. <coughs> Zoom rebuilding reports. I don't know when they'll be finished, basically. I always have trouble reading that little droid's conversation bits. And we are magically down here because reasons. But now, it's time to head out onto Balmora. We have some resistance members to save, and some Sith to beat the crap out of. Alrighty, we are here on Balmora. Time to head back, time to head onto the surface and into a war zone. I can tell you right now, even though I don't know much about the planet, this is not going to be fun. Not in the slightest. Republic Orbital Station, so we're in orbit, not actually on the planet of Belmore itself yet. Not surprising. I don't expect that Republic naval warships exactly have clearance to land on a planet that's technically controlled by the Empire. And so we have to use a station. Probably a hidden one, too. I'm sorry Belmore to detain you, Master Jedi, arc. but this is an emergency. We're trying to break an Imperial occupation on Balmora. 
But the Republic's got no ground, no resources, and right now, no chance. That never stopped us before. Why should it now? The Republic's made up of worlds that didn't have a chance. History hasn't exactly been repeating itself lately. The stakes are too high here. Thalmoran factories produce the most powerful weapons in the galaxy. Possess them, win any war you want. The Republic must retake Balmora, but we need reinforcements. Okay, and where should I begin looking for these hypothetical reinforcements? I can't exactly create an army out of thin air. I'm a Jedi, not a miracle worker. Is Balmora a complete war zone? We've managed to make a beachhead in a place called Bugtown that the Empire overlooked. Commander Maydeen requested all reinforcements see him at Republic headquarters. Can he expect you? Yes, he can. I believe the Empire's worn out their welcome. From the stories I hear, I think the Balmoran people would agree. I'll inform the commander. You'd better get on board. Good luck. Definitely. So, we're going to be assisting the Balmorans in kicking the Empire off their world. This ought to be fun. going to be fun. We get to break an Imperial occupation. I wonder what this is going to entail. Probably blowing up a lot of things. Flashpoint, you say? What is this? Scanning facial features and matching to identifiable records. Stand by. Identity confirmed. You are the Jedi Knight who defeated Darth Hangro and saved multiple Republic worlds. Opening hollow channel to Republic Fleet Admiral Jedi Master Otake. Stand by. Channel open. Hello. My name is Otake. I serve the Jedi Order and lead the Republic's first expeditionary fleet. I need your help. I have a feeling this is bad news. Very bad news. What is it? If a Jedi Master and Fleet Admiral needs me, the situation can't be good. Good and bad are relative. Let's just say the situation is interesting. I've received intelligence that the Empire has a secret prison inside the Maelstrom Nebula. It's a dangerous region. Interesting, Impossible you to say. safely navigate. A Jedi prisoner possessing vital information is held captive there. That could describe half to my career, honestly. Interesting could describe half my career with the Jedi Order, honestly. Uh, what sort of information are we talking about? What could this Jedi prisoner know that would be worth such a risky operation? Direct knowledge of the Emperor's plans. Insights the Republic oh, will need to win the coming war. I'm aboard Direct the first expeditionary fleet's command ship, the, the Dreadnought Tilos. Transmitting coordinates now, and please keep them to yourself. Oh, take out. Uh, yes. To those of you curious, I do know precisely what this flashpoint happens to be. Because I've seen some videos in the past on YouTube about this particular operation, so I know what it is. Looks like you stepped in something. Colicoid nest. All the places to land Even on if I'm not remembering the precise details. But this is a flashpoint we are going to be doing. No doubt about that. But... We're going to have to get a group before we can do it. We're going to have to group up with a few people, so it may be a little while. But that will make its way into this Let's Play at some point. I have to admit. Now, Sergeant Manns, I think this is the... Uh, 
person we were supposed to talk to? I Colicoids? What are colicoids? Is that some kind of native animal? Faguta Gioto and Maguli ji want a humpa, muli ra wata wumpa. Wasta mi cha kol kuka tu maji, ta ushagwa upa. Well then, we'll have to do something about it, won't we? Why don't you let me deal we? with this? Faguta ji oto endiya. I'm a Jedi. This is what we're here for. No worries, Sergeant. I'll take care of them. Now, where are we supposed to go? Around the wreckage, speak to this commander, and, and kill off bunch of Colicoid Patriarchs and their Stingers. Those are our primary objectives right now. Up to here then, for the person we're actually supposed to speak to. Because that was not them. Not going to be getting any of those heroic missions. Com companion customization vendor. See anything you like, give me a wink. What have you got for me? I like to back hear it time. as she is, actually. Not going to be doing that. I love what they've done with the place. You could almost forget this was a colicoid nest. Yeah. Well, give them this. The Republic sure is good at getting uh, the place looking good and effective. Yeah, they sure do a good job of getting their bases up and running fast, that's for sure. Now, Commander Medin, hello. Lieutenant I'm Hollis told help. me he found the best help in the galaxy, but I wasn't expecting a Jedi. I'm Commander Medin. We both know why you're here, so I'll lay out the details. The Empire's taking control of Belmora's satellite defense system. It's only a matter of time before they find Bugtown and blast us out of this swamp. How does this defense system work precisely? That's one powerful satellite. The satellites detect enemies, and orbiting turbo lasers blast them apart. The Empire's got us cornered. As long as they have that satellite system, they're going to keep Balmora. But if we could get control of the satellite system, we could turn it on the Empire and even the score. Yes, a very good plan indeed. But wouldn't you need orbiting ships to be able to do something like that? Because from what I'm hearing, they have a fleet around here that does the blasting, the satellites just find stuff. So how would this work? How do you plan to accomplish this? My best agent managed to gather some intel, but he never made it back. His ship was shot down. I need someone to enter Imperial territory, find Agent Jago's downed ship, and recover the intel. Okay. What makes you think the intel is still there, though? How do you know the Empire doesn't already have it? If the Empire has cracked Agent Jago's encryption, we'd be hearing about it elsewhere. Trust me. Use this decryptor to verify the intel's contents. Then contact me through the comm station at the shuttle pad. Alright. I gotcha. I understand completely. 
I'll wait for your comm call. Good luck up there. Alrighty then. We are in a pretty good place now. We're, we can get started now, because this is definitely going to be a long-term goal to break the Empire's hold on this world. Since they appear to be pretty damn determined to keep it. But, it's definitely worth doing. Because it appears the locals are getting pretty fed up with having the Empire around here. And I would be more than happy to assist them with showing the Empire the door, so to speak. And now I'm going to cross like that, because I don't think I could make that jump. Because reason and because experience. Let's talk later. Feels like we ought to be saving the galaxy right now. Okay. Misclick there. That'd be Kira. And this is only stage one. One of those multi-stage bonuses. Or bone eye, I'm not really sure. It's been a while since we've gotten one of those. The multi-stagers. Last one uh, last time I remember actually getting one of those was back on Coruscant. There were a handful of missions multiple stage bonuses. But, now we got this Patriarch to kill. And this is one mission we're going to do, because it would hardly do to have us establish a Republic foothold in the area, only to have the Republic driven off by bugs. There. That Good won't as do nil. it all. No, no, no. That would not do at all. Hello, my stingy friend. Patriarch, one more stinger I need to find, as well as a couple of eggs. I see an egg over there, as well as sting sting here. Ah. 
giving us the precise location of the ones we need to get rid of. That's good. Less annoying that way. So we don't have to spend all of our time searching for the damn things. We just have to fight for the colicoid. Which I am not very fond of doing. Just because there's a lot of them and they're a Pain in the ass. But on the other hand, they die quickly, which is nice. Now, now, you don't need to be living. That's a travesty. Hurry up and die. Your death will help out everyone. Well, everyone that's not a colicoid, which is all the people that matter. Since colicoids aren't people. Boom. And I see two right here. So we'll go for them. For one thing, they look to be the closest. Rather than that one, which is quite far off, actually. Fortunately, we have this bridge here. Try to skirt around these idiots because I'll fight the ones I have to, but I'm not going around trying to kill every single colic on the planet. That would be very annoying to have to do. Care if you're an enraged patriarch or a cat. Still irritating. 